What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, D. Miller. We back with another video. And as y'all can tell from the title, you know what I'm saying? The screen right here, bro. Andrew Reese then declared for the WNBA. So, you know what I'm saying? Shouts out to her, bro. First off, no cap. And um, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I done had this debate in the um the comments with a couple of people, bro. Like, I'm 50-50 on it. But, like, I low-key thought about it once I found out she declared. And I'm like, bro, to be real, she said it. She did everything she needed to do in college. Like, getting another chip. And getting another, like, another NCAA title, bro, like, I don't really think it do nothing for her. Like, it don't really add too much to her legacy. Like, bro, she did everything she needed to do, bro. She got a natty. Brought the first one to LSU that we ever done one. And <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. We, I mean, we're gonna get one soon, I feel like. But, like, let, realistically speaking, she brought the first one that we ever got. She said she came here to do that. And she did that. I mean, realistically, bro, I don't think she really has no reason to stay, so... Shouts out to her. I'm definitely glad she, you know what I'm saying? Glad she made that decision, bro. I mean, look, looking forward to seeing her in the WNBA. Look, the draft is um, in, what, like two weeks, I think? I think the draft is in like two weeks. So we definitely going to react to that right there. I don't know where she's projected. I got the mock draft right here. But I had wanted to um read this right here. And then I'm going to watch her little video that she dropped. Because I think she, it says she announced it via the Vogue magazine. I ain't going to lie. That's... <laughs> Ain't gonna lie. Anything that she do, bro, she got to do it with, like, some sort of flair, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's lit, though, bro. Let me see. I won a national championship. I got an SEC play of the year. I've been an All-American. My ultimate goal is to be a pro and be one of the greatest basketball players to play ever. I feel like I'm ready. I mean, look. She the only one. that She she know better than us, bro. <laughs> so, at the end of the day, I think. I mean, I think it's time, though. Like, realistically speaking, bro, she has no reason to stay, bro. It, it doesn't. I mean, I don't think it really adds to her. Um, I mean, maybe draft stock, maybe instead of going like what five or six this year, she goes like one or two next year, three, whatever. But honestly, bro, like it's only so long to stay in college. There's no reason to stay for that long for real. But let's see. Let's see what this video what she got, man. All right, let's do this. Four years. Where to begin? So my from? family, be more. my mom, my MVP to Baltimore and the Terps, to LSU, my PMAC home, to my teammates and coaches, managers and trainers. Y'all think she made this decision? God, Hold on, I'm gonna ask that. blessing after. of a life. Thank you. All of this is because Ooh. of you. Thank you for but loving me and supporting me now. in everything I do. Ooh. For standing by me at my lowest, yeah. For making every second of the past four years. Yeah, hold on, bro. We gotta run that back right quick, bro. Ouch. All of this is well, because this, of bro. you. Thank you for loving me and supporting me in everything I do. For standing by me at my Oof. lowest. For making every second of the past four years a dream come true. I'm leaving college with everything I ever wanted. A degree, a national championship, and this platform I could have never imagined. This is for the girls that look like me, that's going to speak up on what they believe in. It's unapologetically you. To grow women's sports and to have an impact on those coming next. This was a difficult decision, but I trust the next chapter because I know the author. Buy you Barbie out. Mmm, nah, that shit was cold, bro. Nah, that was cold, bro. Nah, that was cold. That was cold. I fuck with that right there, bro. Look, hey, man, she did She did something that, I mean, some players will never get the chance to, bro. So, I mean, when you look at it like, when you look at it like that, bro, a degree, a natty, and she now is one of the most recognizable faces. She's a household name. She doesn't turn from... Like, I mean, people probably knew if you knew the game, you knew about her when she was in Maryland. But realistically speaking, she became a household name when she came to LSU, bro. And she backed it up, bro. She talked, she talked her shit, and she backed that shit up, bro. So look, shouts out to her, bro. Looking forward to that next journey. And I was scrolling down, kind of trying to see where they projected her. So they got her at they got her at seven and eight right now. The most the more people got her going eight to the sky, and some people got her going to the links. Now going to the links would be dope. She get the um follow behind Sylvia Fowles and um 
Oh my goodness. Simone Augustus, that would be dope. You know what I'm saying? The like Link's legacy right there. And I I'm trying to think in my head if they even really need her. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, they, the two, well, I don't know who this is right here. It's, I guess she's overseas. So I, I don't know. But Aaliyah Edwards and Angel. I guess so they need a four, maybe. Yeah, I guess they, I guess what they need is a four because I'm trying to think. They got, um, I can't remember who the Lynx got big man wise, but yeah. And then the Sky, that would be cool too. That would be solid too. So either the Sky or the Lynx. I mean, those are two um, dope squads. I think the Lynx would be really cool storyline wise. And um, either way it go, bro, she's going to be successful. I'm excited, bro. I ain't going to lie. This draft is, hey, this draft is better than people think, bro. A lot of people saying, like, the the women's game and Caitlin Clark. And it's like, yes, Caitlin Clark is Caitlin Clark. But, bro, <laughs> we got some nice, bro, Cam Brink, Rakia, Cardoso, Sheldon. A I think Amor is actually staying. She's transferring. Um, But Leah Edwards, like, bro, this draft, this draft got a lot of good players. And I'm seeing a couple of overseas players too so i'm definitely gonna try to tap in with the um these p uh these women right here to see um who they are how they game look but um either way it go shouts out to her college career successful college career bro she made history bro shout out to bro she's an lsu legend bro i don't care i'm dying on that hill she's an lsu legend bro and um yeah man so I got for this. Y'all leave down below y'all comments. I know it's going to be a whole lot of, it's going to be a couple of y'all that actually have common sense and that do like appreciate the game. That's going, you know, round of applause. And it's going to be the dick riders and the haters. Oh, injuries is terrible. She, ooh. I don't care, bro. I'm, wait, however y'all want to comment on it, bro. Y'all could comment on it. I said what I said. Shouts out to her. Legend, as I said. And um, yeah, man, that's how I'm going to end the video. Hope y'all enjoyed. Leave down below y'all thoughts. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video. And I'm going to holler at you on the next one.